Hey guys, what is up here? This is Caleb with uh, Old Vet Gamers, and I'm here to show you uh, an Awads video. And this is about uh, the uh, Cave of Tikrak. And there's apparently there's three different parts, three different uh, truths that or waves that you have to go through. Uh, and I will I only know the first three waves and how to beat them. But so this for Sarn, you're gonna want to chain her. Through you know with the magic chains, she will spawn an ad. All you're going to want to do is you're going to just want to, you know, slow down, DPS the ads. She, I believe she spawns five of them, all different tiers, difficulty. I mean, nothing difficult at all. Let's chain her again. Tainted soul. Really easy. So I will just let you guys watch the rest of this fight. Oh, oh, also I want to talk about uh, what I plan to do in the future is on this channel with this game. Um, recently my guild was um, in, uh, we did Astral, and Astral's kind of like end game, getting geared and stuff with ships that you, you, you can own your own ship. And so, you know, I'll try and film, you know, all the Astral uh, trips that we go on, you know, you know, demon fights that we do, it'll be pretty sick. Um, and then when I hit 51, I'll vid that, and I'll be getting geared. Um, I'll show you getting geared and how hard it is, but, you know, at the, fun at the same time, it's pretty fun. It's always fun getting geared, in my opinion. Much better than questing. But as you can see, this is the last ad. Red ring, mo red ring boss, sort of. But, I mean, it's hardly a boss. Down it's super easy. Let's see, and that's that. That's part one. And so, I believe part two has two waves that you have to go through. So, this one, this boss is pretty easy. Um, you, have, you have him helping you. He's kind of pissed off that this guy's wearing his armor. He's like, oh, hell no. But what you do is you just zap him. He has a shield. You bring a shield down. DPS him. Uh, as, as his health gets lower, you do more damage on him. So it's one of those progressive fights, but... And then you bring, you know, just zap his shield down. Every time his shield goes down, do more damage. Till pretty much you're at full capacity. Use X to heal. And, oh, well, apparently if you zap him when his shield's down, it's an instant kill. <laughs> Alright, sweet. That was ridiculously easy. Alright, and this next one's a little bit more difficult. Um, what it is, is... It's you have to survive for for ten for five minutes from these mobs that will spawn, and you run around and you get these buffs, and these buffs gives you different spells, and so you know you have your healing abilities in case you run out of um, food. You got your damage abilities. And there's even one where you can tank. See that kills some mobs, but not very effective. But I don't know if it's random or not because I haven't really been, didn't pay attention in the last few times I've done this. Seems like I got the same one, you want to gather them up, use that ability on them, heal, and then you just kind of kite them around, as you would on any other MMO. Um, I do know that frost abilities are a little bit more powerful as their AoE damage spells, but I believe it's random which spell you get. As you can see that, I didn't get any. Got my rocket boots, sorry for the lag. See AoE damage damage spell, super easy. One shot them all. The only thing that'll kill you in this is if, if you know, mobs slow you down. And I, I think you might be able to just hold on to this. And I mean, if you can, just hold on to one AOE ability and just run around, as I am doing right now. Let's see, and you don't even need to heal. So, we've got th three minutes left, approximately. Oh, I guess the ability did go away. Go grab it again. Do not want that. So I guess you just use those rocket boots to heal yourself. Please be an AoE damage. 
No, the same thing again. When will they get that I don't want this? It gets it is no use to me. Oh, and there's a shield. And I believe you're impaired to effects when you have the shield, so you can't be slowed or anything. Orb of Shockwave. Need nothing too difficult to heal up. Use this ability. Plunge forward, get away from the adds. And almost done. Last time I tried this, I was filming and I died literally as I had six seconds left. It was just ridiculous. And then use a Z just to kill one mob at the time. Go grab this frost ball looking thing. And right, sweet AoE. AoE mull down. And <laughs> zap poor turtle. Didn't stand a chance. So you can use... oh, it's gone. Oh, back again. Super easy. I mean... Just... I mean, this is just a kind of joke, I guess, but... Apparently, <laughs> apparently I struggled with it last my last attempt. Bought my shield... And the cool thing is I believe this allows you to gain reincarns, as I believe it gives you like reincarn spells and lets you, um, you know, what a reincarn is, is basically is when it, one of your characters hits 45, instead of making a brand new alt, um, you can make an alt, a reincarnation of yourself, and what this does is it gets all of your items, like as your runes, it gives all of your runes, oh crap, it gives, it gives you, gives your reincarnation all of your runes, you know, right, all, they get all that so you don't have to buy more runes, I have that much time left, great, don't want to get them too stacked up, I guess it gets harder as you go by, but you get runes, you get, um, and you reincarn your main and your reincarnation, get your special um, class abilities, so you can both use different abilities. So someone who has a reincarn of almost every character will have a lot more abilities from every single class rather than someone who doesn't have a reincarn. So, you know, it kind of, you know, makes you want to level a main. And also, all the mounts you get, all the, all these mounts my reincarnation will have. And so I might make a video on that later, because I've been thinking about doing a paladin. And there we go, finish the second part of the revelation. So I've been, I did a paladin, and... No... I, you know, I'll make a video on that, maybe a leveling series if you guys want to see that. I'm ready for the third part. Read this first. We raised the most time to destroy this prison, so I guess this whole thing's about Sar. He must be the big bad guy at the end of this. Um. Right, well, we will do this. Alright, so here's. Now you must see what difficulties the brave god liked. Now you learn the third part of the revelation. You must fight a real great dragon. Solskar and Argus are just the weaker descendants of the Dragon Keepers and barely fit that title. Ask about the demons. Oh, do I not have to do it? Oh, I guess I do. Dang it. What is that? My oh, I have to survive. And I can only heal. Please don't be more ads. Oh, that was easy. <laughs> Am I done? I'm gonna just alright buff up real quick. Because I doubt I am. Somewhere. Well it looks like it's in waves. Oh I hate my having no, almost no gear. Being mis dodging like I am I'm sent at the time, but you know what what can I do? What can I do? Nothing. There we go, nice 114k crit. Right, so I thought Brandon shot. I'm gonna get close to him and then jump back. Hopefully, take this one out. But as you can see, I'm taking not a lot of damage, and plus, I get healed for everything, so. 
So as a, as a lower level, this would be much more difficult. So I'm assuming you'd ha you'd have to run, you know, these trials several several times. But I mean, if it's not if it's your first time, yeah, it's a little difficult. But and what is this? I have no clue what is going on. Alright, this is ridiculous. Alright, definitely want to heal. Always want to enchant tranquil arrows. So you take one of these out. Single. I'm, I'm just going to single them off because that's. Oh, well, that was. <laughs> it's like expecting, you know, Red Ring boss. I was expecting a little bit more HP than that. You know, run around, you know, general, you know, scout basic abilities, which I'll make a guide on this later. If, Know how to pretty effectively play your scout. Super easy. Right, I'm gonna want to enchant these in my spare time. Cause I've, cause you're gonna want to kite and slow through the mobs. You know, kind of. All right, here we go. This should be easy. Oh Jesus! All right, take him out first. See, he has a fair bit more health, but my since I'm level 50, I mean, I pretty much ignore that and just do as max damage that I can. Uh, another interesting thing is um, your damage um, greatly in increases by your combat level. So I would do a lot more damage on level 46 at 50 than I would on like a level 50 or 51. So that also is greatly helping me through this entire trial. Use that just because. Buff up again. <laughs> I only I do. It's a habit. When I played World of Warcraft. This is what I did. And I'm going to use Tesla Shot. Some, something big is just gonna like randomly pop up and kill me. Yep. Oh no, I. I hope I don't have to fight that because I. There's no way. Nehas. Wait, what is this? Oh sweet Jesus. Oh. Thank you, Sarn, or not Sarn the Haas, little what? A dragon. <laughs> I have no idea what just happened. Alright, so that is the cave of Tickback, and I'm going to stop my vid here, so um f you know, a light thanks you get uh well <laughs> you know, jumbled mess. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, you know, every view counts, you know, every time I see, you know, ten or eleven people more people have watched my video, you know, I feel feel so much better about myself. I'm like, hey, you know what? People enjoy my content. And it takes less than two seconds to leave a like. So if you could leave a like, that would be great. And I will upload a few more videos. Uh, so thank you guys for watching and have a good day.